So yeah, like I say, is pieces of shit like this that want to destroy our life. He's got a black pickup and this here and they have been parked in my neighborhood forever. And right where I'm parked, they were parked. There's my gray van that I moved there. This guy here parked here shortly after and I think it's a rental, I ain't sure. I don't care. But there's my van and there's a construction vehicle ahead of me that got here earlier and so on and so forth. But literally, they parked in, by this sign, by this business, and look at that. Made by me. They were on the news with us, with my RV. This here RV was on the news with uh, that backdrop right uh, there. And the lady who owns this was barking about my RV being an eyesore parking in front of her place. Mine at least moved every day. But that there eyesore was here for almost a month. And they're native. And they say, we don't have to follow white man rule. Uh, what? It's a bylaw. It's a government rule. Everybody needs to follow by 24 hour rule over 20 feet. And they're now once again in the Walmart parking lot going to get towed tomorrow morning I guarantee you cause they're fucking retards and they're going to destroy it for every motherfucker that wants to live free but this fucking retard wants to destroy it for everyone because fuck you and the bylaws and the Fuck you and all the fucking things that are in the government laws. Because I'm above the laws because I'm a native motherfucker. Fuck the natives. They shouldn't even get a dime from us Canadians because we've already paid for it over a hundred years. That was your grandparents' grandparents that we fucked over. This is over a hundred years going on. You should not get a dime from us anymore as a native person. Native people are people that are born and raised over a hundred years ago. You are no longer a native. You are a minority. Minorities are even me. That came with Christopher Columbus. This is bullshit that you can destroy my civ civilization and my freedom by I can do whatever I want and they even have a generator outside of their RV and they leave it there all the time constantly never ever ever is it unchained unless they move their RV and you can hear it running now I'm gonna walk around these pellets and I'll kind of do it stealthily because they're in it see generator that little pickup truck here of their XTR and they also own a Dodge Charger they think they're above the laws because they're fucking native and they can do what they want. They've been towed out of this parking lot once. I want to watch it tomorrow morning when Eric says, fuck you, I gave you a chance once. You broke it. Bite me.